in my opinion, not only as a citizen, but also as a scientist, is that all public health policies must include everyone and must work for everyone. There are still currently so many people, so many groups, like people with allergies, with rare genetic disorders, with neuropathy and other medical conditions, or also simply who just do not want to have the current vaccine. There are still many, many people out there who simply cannot get the current vaccines and push for more general vaccines or more tolerable vaccines like Novavax, which is protein-based. Many people are willing to take, even if they do not have medical conditions, who also just still want to have another alternative, another option, which is understandable in my opinion. And I would appreciate when public health officials and also MDs would understand that one size does not fit all in medicine. We all know that. That's why there's something called precision medicine, right? So everyone is different. I understand there's a pandemic. However, in order to be able to overcome this pandemic or end this pandemic, everyone must include it. That's the point, right? So if it's been suggested that everyone must be vaccinated, then these vaccines must work for everyone. That's the whole point. Pandemic is for everyone. Vaccines that will prevent further mutations and further infections, and to be able to end this pandemic, they all must work for everyone. And unfortunately, this is not the case. This is why Novavax must be approved ASAP. If we are pushing forward with mandates without taking in consideration that there are so many still unvaccinated because of multiple reasons, and they can be also valid, it does not have to be medical especially the ones with medical conditions that are not fitting the bill, they should be included. Otherwise, it is discriminatory. Everyone must be included. And precision medicine says just that. There are so many people who are also writing to me and saying that they just cannot, and the doctors advise they cannot take this current vaccine because they have this rare genetic disorder, which is reality, which is a truth. And we cannot just, we cannot tell these people, you are now excluded from the society because you have this genetic disorder and you cannot take the vaccine. This is discriminatory. And these people are also taxpayers, right? And all these vaccines were developed by taxpayers. So they have, every one of us, have a right to ask for alternatives. So we have to include everyone. That's my point. That's what public health means. It's what ending a pandemic means, including everyone. We cannot cherry pick a group of people that may be healthy and may be elderly and force everything that they can take to everybody else. That doesn't work and every MD should know that. I'm a scientist. I can only talk about scientific facts and every scientist who worked in the lab would be able to see that clearly, clearly. And everyone who educates the public about science also know that it is important to educate the public. It's important to explain why the masks are there and which masks can protect you and how and how you have to wear them. Not two years later. It had to be done constantly. All the public education has to be done constantly. If we care about misinformation, that's not public's fault. That's the fault of officials are unable to educate the public properly and precisely. And also don't come from the top to bottom approach. It has to be down here. It has to be down here. 
Science has to be explained down here. That's what I do for years. Because that's the only way you can approach people in a correct way. And maybe simply with a simple explanation, change their mind. And I have seen this a lot around me. A lot. Because people just simply don't know. You can't force things upon people if they don't understand it. Think about a baby, a five-year-old. You explain, right? You explain. And then the child thinks twice about it. So that's the whole point. Again, we must include every single person in this. Excluding people is discriminatory. It's also against the right because all of us are taxpayers. All of us paid. All of us helped develop these vaccines, including Novavax. So Novavax must be approved ASAP by the FDA. That's it.